Hi everybody! So here it is, spring is here and May is rolling in. Now many of you know that my Ron and I are winter Texans and I'm sure that many of you don't know. That means that we live here for six months in Texas and we live in Ohio the other six months and it's about that time to leave. Now if you look behind me, you'll notice that all my kitchen utensils are gone. As a matter of fact, everything is gone from this home. And maybe you are even hearing an echo in here. And that's because there's absolutely nothing left in here except me and my Ron and the camera. And that is it. We're all packed and we're anxious to get back to Ohio. But don't fear because I've got tons of recipes that I'm going to be sharing with you. But I wanted to let you know that this will be the last time you see me in this kitchen. Now last spring when my Ron and I were here and we were getting ready to go back to Ohio, we decided to put our home up for sale. And so we thought, well, when we get back, we'll be looking around for our permanent home here in Texas. So all this time that my Ron and I have been here, we have been looking around, but if it hasn't been one thing, it's been another. And we have yet to find that perfect, permanent home here. Now we know that we're not going to be coming back to this house again. Just when I was getting used to this kitchen, you know, because in Ohio I have my refrigerator over here and my stove over here and I face you this way and then over here I've got my refrigerator over here, the sink over here, you know, and having to get used to a new kitchen and then going back to the other kitchen, it can get a little confusing sometimes, but I was all comfortable, everything was running smooth, and now it's time to go back. But that's the way it is. I'm excited to get back because many of you know that I love to work in my yard. Not only do I just love being in the kitchen and sewing and doing all these other things, but I love to work in the yard. Now, I do have a video showing you my front and backyard back home in Ohio. So I'll put a link below if you want to see that. But right now, the yard is not looking pretty at all. You know that back in Ohio, you know, we've got lots of cold weather and snow. So everything has been dormant and it all looks like it's dead and dry and all that. So I'm so anxious to get back and start putting in my flower beds and I've got all my pots ready for my herbs. You know, I usually have basil and thyme and rosemary and cilantro and all these other things. So I've got, I left all my pots ready in the garage and I can't wait to get back and start get, getting everything together and looking nice and fresh and springy and alive again. In the backyard, you know we have a lot of grapes in the back so we've got to get back and we've got to clean all that up and bring out our furniture that we brought in and our mud room is full of furniture from the backyard and from the front yard and we've got to take everything out again and clean up inside and so there's a lot of work now if you've ever gone away and stayed away for a few months you know that when you get back there's a lot of work that needs to be done so you should see our vehicle right now it is packed all the way up. Tons of stuff inside. I have new dishes that I'm dying to show you. And I've got some Mexican ollas, you know, kitchen towels and pot holders with a Mexican theme on them and all that. And I haven't used them yet. So I'm excited to get back and use them so that you can see them. In my mind, I've already been thinking, well, I'm gonna fix this and I'm gonna prepare this and I'm gonna fix that. But I wanted to tell you, that this is the last day that you will see me in this kitchen because it was only temporary. So send me a comment, tell me who you are, let me know what's going on with you so that I can send you a virtual hug. So I wanted to share this with you so you can know exactly what's going on with me. And next time that you see me, I'm gonna be in my Ohio kitchen and I can't wait. So thank you and I'll see you then. Bye.